dashing through the snow in one horse open sleigh. <laughs> Or the fields we go, <laughs> laughing all the way. <laughs> <laughs> we're here, we're here. Welcome, welcome. My happy quilters, my happy Christmas quilters. Oh my gosh. We got, we got. Treed, snow, winter. We got wreaths and snowmans. I know. Oh, I I was going to say we got snow, but we don't anymore because it's been rainy. Right. So anyways, yeah. <laughs> so we're so happy that you joined us here live from Rochester, Minnesota at Pine Needles Quilt and Sew. You would think we'd save this kind of fun for next week, for the Christmas week. Oh, there'll week, be but... more. There'll oh, be oh more. she's got, but wait, so there's more. I can't That's really the best. see very good, so I'm going to take these off. All you can right. leave these on if you want, but. Well, we'll see how long. Oh, this is kind of cool. <laughs> we don't put them back on Hi, at the Mary. end, maybe. <laughs> This is kind of cool. Today we have the comment view, Marsha. Oh, we do. I don't know what kind of magic Mary we did. Mary Coleman's but... out there. Yeah, we can see who they are. All right. Be sure I... to like, comment, and share on our show. I'm going to take my reads off so I don't oh, have double vision. Dang it. Yeah. Okay, like, Not comment, and share. Not dang it, but. <laughs> no, I was going to, but I've got an idea. So like, comment, and share every time we give away three prizes. Right. And one for the um, trivia, winner. trivia winner. So we happen to have four really cute pillowcase kits okay excellent for christmas so shall we show them now or do you want to wait till well we'll, we'll, we'll wait we'll to show later. them but this time you want to like come and share for a really oh, cute look christmas. at that we got colleen and sandy oh, and, hello, and judy. judy and Jeannie. and we, if we miss anybody we, if we keep reading the comments we will have you here all afternoon so we better exactly get, get on we better get right, going Russia. all right so um but yeah. i'm so excited we could read the comments live i know it took us a while to figure that all out, didn't it? It was totally well, we could random have if mistake. We had, I could do them on our, my cell phone, but I can't have my cell phone here. No. I would just be so distracted. And it, if you haven't noticed, I'm kind of easily distracted anyway. Didn't notice that about you. <laughs> no, not at all. Okay, shall we move on? <laughs> yes, did you know that Santa Claus is very, very um, scared of getting stuck in the chimneys? Did not, but I can see why. He has a very bad case of claustrophobia. Oh, man. Claustrophobia. <laughs> All right, I don't know this woman. I'm going to put the glasses back on again. <laughs> okay. All right. <laughs> Why does Santa have three gardens? Why does Santa have three gardens, Marsha? So he can ho, ho, ho. Oh, wow. Okay, be sure you remember that one for the dinner table tonight, folks, because that is a keeper. Okay, that very is much one of so. your better ones, actually. Yeah, well, Santa jokes. <laughs> here we go. I love Christmas time. I do too. However, this is springtime fabric right here. It is. So we have some new it's fabric. It's already gloomy out, isn't it? It is. It is kind of, well, yeah, it kind of feels more like a melting spring day than it does right? a winter day. So anyways, we have this fun, fun fabric that just came in from our friends at Moda. And I'm going to just give that one to you for now. My favorite. But look at this pretty, pretty stuff. Now, this was actually uh, picked out by Susie. Now, she doesn't pick out too often, but she loves this line. Um, and it's called Happiness Blooms by Deb Strain. And it's just yummy. It's uh, different shades of aqua green kind of sort of they're just gorgeous marcia really pretty so let's take a peek at them all right here we go all right so kind of some ferns and roses are my you're right right good. over here yeah right about there all okay right. and here's just a tone on tone this looks like a, a marble that's interesting because it's got little splotches in it it looks it, it looks like a linen but it's got little splotches yeah. i love mm -hmm. it and um, a little ferns, gray on a on a kind of a beige background, and bigger ferns and ferns and leaves and fun things. And more ferns. I love these. These She's have already been, dream, dreaming of spring, isn't she? These have been really. Um, these aren't true ginghams; they're printed ginghams, so, but they're really cute. I like them. But that is so classic and classy. That gorgeous taupe gray color. It is. Little roses here, and then we also. Oh, can you hear the pounding? That's happening next door, so I'm sorry if it's if it's. Uh, I think maybe we hear it more than they do. It's progress, though. It's progress. Yep. So here's another print. I think this is kind of the main print. And look at this is the we enter into that little bit of blue green teal color. Right, and then here it comes. Beautiful. Kind of a washed out, and here's another one of these. 
I like them. Actually, I like these better than the, the ginghams. Did you have to? Did you have to make a? No, you're a different generation than me. But we had to make gingham aprons. It was our first sewing project in 4-H. Was I gingham aprons? Did not aprons. have to do gingham aprons. Because but I was not too old for gingham. Right. We had to, um, cause to get things straight. We had lines to follow. You had to follow lines. Yeah. Okay. Going so back been, down here. You oh, were, sorry. You were, you were chit chatting out there. I digress. You did, yes. So. Um, more of this beautiful blue, blue color and different prints. You know, it reminds me a little bit of ocean beach calming colors. It a little is. bit of sea glass. There's just a tiny little bit of a golden yellow. I know, that little pop of color um, is gorgeous. Home together. It says it's the Family, words. love. Yep. Well, we've got a couple of quilts that we're making out of this, and actually a set of pillows. I think Sandy took home a set of pillows okay. um, that we're making out of this. Now we're going into the little bit darker greens. The checks. I love those the checks. Just, Look at this. There's another one of those marbles. It's kind of a... Yes. really like that. It's a little bit new. It's not really like a marble because these are a little deeper colors in there. So, And then we have that kind of a charcoal colored background. And some charcoal. There's gingham. Beautiful. Checks. I guess it's checks. It's just a bit softer than black. It is. I really like it. Wow, look at all those colors. And here's this. Yep. I just love those. And, and what's this. interesting about it is it's marble, but it really does have a wee bit of a linen type yeah. look. It's not linen at all. No. But it has that little bit of textural okay. print. So we have all these bolts here already, and we have the pre-cuts. So let's show that up here. So we got the layer cakes. And the jelly rolls. Yes. And the charm packs, and I believe we oh, have... we have, you have the mini charm the there. Minis. Oh, you know what we forgot to show in the pack? Hold on a minute. She oh, gave me oh, the, yes. Marcia gave me the panel, so let's show that up. This is in the fat quarter pack. And also on a bolt. Correct, and these are just fabulous. And you know, some of our Doug Lee Cole patterns that, that, you know, these, well, it doesn't have to be Doug Lee Cole, but any pattern that has a center square, big print idea, take a look at them and revisit them because this is a great uh, redo of patterns because you can do these little center motifs and put them inside of another quilt block, like a churn dash or a log cabin, Oh gosh, that would be great with a log cabin. Would, just you would skip all those small centerpieces and exactly. go big right away because this would make a I great. I think this might be a six, but you could even make it, a, you know, whatever because you have probably you, you have some background inch and a half in the in the margin to because do some of these are circle well. and some of them are rectangle. But this is a fun, fun little sentiment. Or okay, cheap and cheerful as they would say, you could even do a picture frame around it you and could. use it on the wall to coordinate with your quilt lovely, and that would lovely give... family sayings on those ones yes. it just makes your heart happy sing it does make the heart sing okay look what else came new yay i love these okay i'm the queen of project bags and recently mm. i've been sorting my house out a bit and i think i have too many but i really don't because there's always room for another project bag and these are sold in a set of three. They are. There's three of them. Mm -hmm. Well, right, but I yeah, love we them. have to take them out. We have to take them out because what I love about these bags that we have is, first of all, this is a great handle. I have a ton of those, but I need more. Mm -hmm. But you can put your projects, as you know. And or you can see them on both sides. You can see them on both sides. But then you could put your other smaller bits so if you're going off to retreat or even if you just want to organize your sewing room. You can put... In my life, it would be maybe all my scissors. Mm -hmm. And now I know this is a larger bag, but honestly, my scissors all could live together. Or if you have or a little charm pack table runner project, we'll right. go in the smaller bags as well to keep everything all together. So there's those New Year's resolutions that we're going to organize our sewing rooms. So it would be a great time to order these and have them for when you're ready to start sorting out your stuff. Now, I have my, I put my slap band on so I could remember. You did. And, okay, uh, I could write a book, 101 uses for these slap bands. Because, of course, they are cool like that, right? Yes, they are. The Power stickers cords. are hanging on very good. Power cords. Do you ever need to 
snug up your power cords in your house. These are great to put around them to keep them corralled. But also when you go to class here at our shop or elsewhere, these go around your power cord very nicely. And because they're bright green, it helps you locate that black power cord in your sewing bag. Mm -hmm. Stabilizers is what we use a lot of them for. Yep, a lot of them. But you can also put this around a bundle of fabric. Yep. So they're very nice, easy to use. There's just a couple purposes. Right, we just and we just got these in and they have pine needles on them. So yay hooray for And they're only $4.99 and, and again such a very useful uh, item there that we have. I know. Okay, so this is kind of a fun thing and I think I think you should crinkle it really good. I think oh no, here they are. Can you hear that? So I think they can. We put crinkly fabric in all of this and then I went and had um Kate long arm this. So this is a cute, cute soft book. I think I'm gonna go down here. Okay. And show them this. So it has the handles and it comes like this. So this is it's just a it's yard goods and all the instructions are on here. But as you open this up, you know you can see C here is for cat, D is for dog. So every page has something for them to H is for hippopotamus, and there's a little hippopotamus in there. And J is for a jellyfish, and see the names on the top. So you just keep going through this fun book, and we put crinkly stuff in all of it, so it's kind of fun for the kids. So it's not really a quiet book. It's not really a church book, probably. But a lot of fun, because But honestly, if your child was sitting in front of me and dribbling on this book and crinkling it, I would be so happy that you were in church. Yeah, I know, and then it comes with two finger, finger puppets. puppets, too, in there. But all the directions are, and see, and it's got these little carrying handles. It's really cute. So back up on top. I love those. I'm yeah. surprised you didn't let me be a, a, a pipe today, too. I should have. But um, so I actually, we quilted these with some fabrics, just some plain muslin on the back. And then I just bound the pages and put them all together like this. And did so, you put flannel? There, yes, flannel. There's one layer of flannel and then the crinkle fabric in there. So we didn't really put batting because it would have been a little bit too thick. Right. I mean, it could have worked, but. Yeah, and if you're gonna make this, I don't recommend putting the crinkle fabric in here because it made them really hard to turn. So just, so the just two in the big layers of fabric, of right. But this is called the multi-panel. In case you're looking for it in the shop, it comes like this. Doesn't look anything like that. Some assembly required. Yep, and all the directions are printed on here too. So really easy, fun to make. This is a really fun line of fabric that we have in our store with all the different critters and, and zoo animals it's on it. It's called ABC XYZ, isn't it? Or ABC I 1, 2, 3? Actually, I don't know. know. I just say that, look at this really cute fabric every time I walk it by it. It is really fun. Well, we've seen a lot of quilts on our uh, customers' quilts coming through on the long arms right? made of these fabrics too. Right? And, they, and they haven't even been here that long, so I think somebody's getting some fun Christmas presents. So to answer Celia's question, yes, we do have the sweatpants in our in our shop, so you can pick up some, get a few, because you're going to want them. And again, stock up, because we're going to get that snow sometime, and you're going to want to be ready for organizing. now. This is my favorite way to organize a bag. Marcia's got it now. This? The zipper pulls. There's nothing more fun than putting your project in a project bag and then putting a fun Let's charm let's on. Let's go up close on these ones too so they can really see them. These are gorgeous. Now they say zipper pulls, but honestly I've never you put one actually on. You can use them for on, anything, zipper well, charms. I do put them on zippers, but not. I put them on these zippers, like right here. Oh, sure, absolutely. Or if you've made one of those fun little, um, what do you call those charm, charm, charm bags? Uh, you know, yeah, you'll think I of it. Know. But anyways, little car these are Christmas themed ones. We also have some sewing themed ones out front too. But I just thought we would feature these. These are from our good friends at Moda and they are really uh, nice quality. Yeah, so these would be fun stocking stuffers. You could put them in my stocking. You stock my stuff. My stuff. You go stock back up front, or are we? Well, yes, you stock okay. my. She stocks my stuffing out. Stuffs my stocking all the time. The thing <laughs> I gave you yesterday, though, couldn't fit in your stocking. No, <laughs> I'd have to make a bigger one. All right, we have 
thanks to all of you run out of our gift bags, but we still want to include something special with our gift card purchase uh, person. So we're on to plan B because uh, as any good thing, you oh, know, we didn't put a card in here, but we We, we didn't will. put a gift card, but with a gift card purchase of over $25, we're going to include a Christmas tin while supplies last, two little bobbin keepers, so this keeps your bobbins with your thread, and then a mini yep. charm of our choice. Yep. So that's going to be fun. If any of you need to get some gift cards, um, this I would love this in my stocking. And then when I open it, it would be a gift card in there too. Yay! And, and of course, the great thing is... You know, one size fits all, but the bigger the denomination, the more size it fits, right? That's right. That's right. Okay. Yeah. Yep. And then the other thing, we oh. still have a few of these left, and it's all really right. fun. All right. I cannot believe we even have any of these left, because these are the cutest things ever. But we have fat quarters in here, three of them that are coordinated. They're snowflakes. Yes. Cocoa and coffee. I bet you wanted me to get the open one, didn't you? You don't have to open it, no. We have a little package of marshmallows called Some Assembly Required for the Snowman. snowman. There's a adorable stir spoon in here, and of course the coffee mug and a peppermint stick. So we've covered it all. You could really have a party in a cup here. And in case you missed it, my favorite thing about these cups is that they're slightly curved, and they keep your hands really nice and warm. And it, my house is cold in the morning when I get up, so I really appreciate this shape. This would be great um, for any quilter or secret Santa type gift or any of that kind of right. stuff. So a few of those left. Those have been really popular and fun. So let's talk about the pillowcases. Let's just show the kits and the pillowcases. So we kind of always, um, fun for kids, fun for kids stockings, fun for adult stockings, fun for college, your college kids stockings. I need a bunch. Okay, so the worst part about being here, not the worst part, because it's really <laughs> not. I mean, seriously, you can all cry for me. The worst part is, picking these fabrics for this pillowcase and then I have to buy one of every one because we know, do such a good job. I, I think we do a good job. So but, these, this one here has little Christmas balls with bikes and trees and it's kind of green background with them with this. And look at how adorable that is. If you have a beginning sewer in your life, yep, these this are great is kids. a great... And over Christmas vacation, now you can make it for them, but why not, ha why not help them make this? These are great for grandkids over the holiday vacation. And be sure to pick up some Wonder Clips because they won't stab themselves and they are the best little tool. You could get just a little 10 pack if you wanted. Oh, look at oh, here. Okay, so here, this one has a campers and Christmas, this is campers, kind of um, all decked out for Christmas um, with the, the lights and the cuff here and a red thing. And again, here's the kit. And Janet wraps these up so that there's no doubt as to where what goes where. She does a really nice she job. She makes them look just like it. And you know what, Marcia? We have this beautiful pine needle, needles twill ah, ribbon. Yes. Again, a great organizing tool in your sewing room, so be sure to save the ribbons to organize well, she's your She's got goodies. this one. So then we have the same thing in green, only with uh, the argyle down at the bottom. So these are little green background with the same Christmas I campers. I love these. I love these. Okay, and then last but not least. The Christmas words. I love this one too. But it also says happy camper, holiday cheer, tis the season. So this has a little bit of a camping, bells. fun summer theme, even though it's a winter time thing. And whether you get them all or, or some. So I've shared with Marsha, I just recently made a bunch of these because I wrap my Christmas gifts to my kids in them. Instead of having wrapping paper, because that costs a lot of money and it ends up in the garbage the next day, I put the gift in the bag and tie it up. And actually, I could tie it up this year with the pine needles. Ribbon. You could. There you go. So it's the wrapping and the gift all in one. Absolutely. All right. So it's time for our trivia question for this Are week. you ready? Okay. So I am ready, spaghetti. You ready for sp This was a long one. Now, the first one <laughs> yeah, to get the one. answer typed into Susie's computer will win one of these lovely pillowcase kits, correct, that we have? That is correct. The first, the first person um, to get the... Um, Correct answer to Susie's Correct. machine. All right. Okay. Oh, wait. Hold on. Somebody says, can they see the blue camper one? Yes. Okay, let's say that this blue camper is going to be for the winner of the trivia. Right. This this pillowcase will be for the winner of the trivia. Isn't it's that cute? It's super, super, super cute. So it has those little classic um, ham can, ham can campers on them. Yep. Fine. Right. Ready for little, the trivia. Little nostalgia. Here we go. All right. So, regarding a stencil that is used for drawing lines or using a pouncer for quilting, 
What is the name for the little solid spaces between the lines that keep the stencil together? This was a long trivia question. It is, and I did not know the answer. On the I'm going to do it again. Regarding a stencil that is used for drawing lines or using the chalk pouncer for quilting, what is the name of the little solid lines between the lines that keep the stencil together? Did you know the answer to this? I did not. I did not either. <laughs> So Chantel we'll just wait Inglitz, until we laughing. hear from Susie. And then also we've got a couple of these. These have been so popular, the Lori Holt calendars. Oh my goodness. So she has a new line of fabric called Prairie Prairie. And we don't have the fabric. We have a, we some fat quarter packs. Mm -hmm. But I think having a beautiful calendar is important to the success of my year. <laughs> I do. Yeah, I know. That's my excuse, and I'm sticking okay, with it. Okay, there you go. I'm a so they, look at these gorgeous, fun pages. Applique. I won't go through the whole one, but it's an extremely sturdy calendar. Look at that. Are the patterns included or not? They Sometimes are not. They just, are. just the prettiness of it. But if yep. you're a, just the loveliness. So it's a slow, look at December of next year. Pretty. It's gorgeous. Okay, so Lori Holt, we have a few of those. All right, and then, look at that. So <laughs> back into the getting organized, it's called Be Organized. How adorable are these? Pink, aqua, blue, red. They're blue, a set blue, of three, blue, and they blue, are blue. plastic with, with metal lids, I believe. Yep, so. the lids are metal. Yep. I already very, have some in my very, sewing very cute. studio. <laughs> Excuse me. Mm -hmm. Well, they're coming in with great uh, answers, but I don't see the right one, but we don't have to... Susie monitors yeah, all that absolutely. good stuff. Absolutely. Um, well, let's talk about what's going on out there. Even though it's messy, we do have a mess out there right now. And just so you know, it's 25% off all of Christmas and fall fabrics right now because they're kind of. Because they're, they're not in their proper homes. We're bursting at the seams and the aisle where they, well, that's what the theme is, but they're bursting. We are bursting at the seams. And because we had to move them all, we thought we should put them on sale so that as you buy the fabric, we'll have more walk space until we get in our new space. But on that theme, Marcia, this year, Bernita's promotion is called Bursting at the Seams. It is. S-E-A-M-S. -E and we have some specials. So there's just a little bit of time left in this year, but the all Bernita luggage, presser feet, and hoops are 25% off. And we also have a free surger, air threading surger, the L860 will go with a purchase of an 880 or 790 Bernina sewing machine. But we have one holiday event left in our life here at our store before we close out the year. So because of that, we have a 60 month 0% financing option coming up to our store only, yep. December 21st through the 23rd. Of course, we always like cash and check. It's, it's, That's an option too. It's not too. a nationwide. It is it's not a nationwide. Um, but you know, the thing of it is, if you want to, it's the twenty first, twenty second, twenty third. But if you want to yep. come in ahead and choose your bringing a sewing machine, pre-order, um, pre-order, and they take it home, and then we'll just run it on one of those days. And we also have. Here, we better go down here. Okay. We also have this. They have two promotions at Bernina, and it's fun with all these flowers. I was going to bring the K Facet machine in, but I got interrupted mid mid stream. So we have this gorgeous little aqua aqua machine, the 475. That would be a great gift under the tree to you. And we have some new machines, the 735. Well, this little aqua machine comes with this cute um, case and the matching dust I cover know. too. It's, so, so it's been the it's most awesome. Yep. It has been the most popular. A machine purchase this fall for those who wish to have a second smaller machine to go to retreat or to take camping. We also still have with our top of the line L890 Bernina serger, you get a free overlocker sewing case and um, five feet. Mm -hmm. But we also have baby lock promotions in we our do. store. We do have and all of the baby let lock. Me, let me, oh yeah, you go ahead and then yeah. I'll put a picture up. All of the baby lock right now are 35% off, uh, which is a tremendous deal for all of you. Um, a lot of the things, some of the things, we still have a great selection. Some of the machines we have, have gone out the door already. We still have a good selection. We had quite a few in boxes, so we've got machines in boxes. Um, 
So and the long you, arms are gone. The long arms are gone, but if you want a little machine, the Zest or the Joy, we still have a good selection of those. Those are great small travel machines, but also gift machines for those new sewers in your life. And we have still a few left in boxes of the Bloom and Aurora. Those are machines that just came out now. Plus we've got a plethora of um, bags of feet and um, books, hoops, lots right. of baby lock hoops. Um, now's the time, put your own presents under the tree because when they're gone, they're gonna be gone. And I just put up the picture of the Triumph this is the top of the line baby lock uh, air threading surgery at eight threads. It does a gazillion million stitches. We have some of these new in our box ready to go. And thank you for reminding me about the, um, what you just said before I put up the Triumph. I already forgot. The wow, accessories? That yes, but, the ex oh, the hoops, the magnetic hoops. If you are a Solaris owner out there, you have got to get yourself the big magnetic hoop. We have a nice stock of them on hand, 35% off. That is an outstanding deal. It really is. Deal. And I you're, think you're gonna it's want like that. a $700 value. It is, but it's huge. And, and so versatile. Right, it only works in the Solaris. Sorry. Solaris and Solaris one, two, or three. Yep, and the Solaris Vision. I guess the three is the yes. Vision. Yes, yep. But we have that big hoop in stock ready to go, so you're gonna want that. and. For some of those that have been waiting for the upgrade for the Solaris, we just yeah. got a couple of those in the back door too. So those are 35% off. So if you've been waiting for that Solaris upgrade, you want to come in and get those pretty quick because right. they won't last long. They will oh not. Oh my goodness, we don't have any winners. Of, she said, Susie's shaking her head on the, well, this on the trivia hard. question. It is a hard one. Can I give a hint? Mm -hmm. You want to blank the bet, plural. Oh. I would not have known this. I'm at gonna all. say the things in you the in your yard that you trim. <laughs> okay. We'll see if somebody comes up with it Blank now. Blank the bed with a plural. Blank the bed or trim <laughs> your or they're the little plastic chads that are between the area That's that you right. paint. That's right. That's what they are. Oh, we're getting close, I but remember that. it has to be plural. Okay, there plural. it is. It has to be plural. Oh, yeah, it has to be plural. All right. Ooh, okay. We'll see. Well, we'll wait for Susie's. Susie. We do have an answer, and it's Hedges. We're going to wait for Susie to come and say who the one was. Because one. our computer speeds are even different in our building, and right. what we're seeing on our screen is delayed. Exactly. We are quite a bit delayed. We're like way So, behind. Hedges, who would have known? I did not know that. That is a trivia. We haven't stumped today. I uh, know. It doesn't happen very often that I, we can stump you. Okay, so we have some other goodies on the on the docket. So Baby Lock Triumphs. Honestly, if you need one, we got them. L eight ninety, that's a great option too. We do. Oh yay! Here it comes. It has to be plural. It has to be, has plural. To be plural. Leslie Albert. Yay! Congratulations. She gets the blue pillowcase. Now the remember for all the rest of them. We still we, have three to give away on yeah, so Friday night. Yeah, so be sure to like, comment, and share. And, and we, for those of you that are watching the recording, you count too. So, I, because you know, like we always say, we're working. Right. <laughs> we are. <what>? Really? <laughs> we are working. But for those of you that can't stop your work and, and watch this, you watch it on the recording and everybody still qualifies for the prizes. No. Yes, they do. Now, somebody commented about the quote behind us already. Yeah, I saw really earlier. Oh my gosh. So, this is a classic pattern, in my opinion. It is. This is a Doug Lico pattern. And it's called Reminiscence. And here's the thing. It's tied in here. But the pattern has three options. We went for the easy these, one yes, this time. The fast sew because. Right. But it also you can put um, flying geese in here or you can angle these. And the pattern has all the options. You can do whichever option you want. And then it used you kind of fussy cut this uh, main fabric. So. Um, it's the jelly roll, a little bit of this sashing, and the main fabric that you're going to fussy cut these pieces out of. And if you want to make one of the other options, you'll just have to pick up more yard goods. And be sure to pick up the backing at the same time so that you are ready to finish this quilt when you're Absolutely. ready. Absolutely. But this really is a quick sew, and it's, it's really lovely. I really, really like it. So we have another one behind here, and this is made by our own Laura. She's the gal that does the um, shipping. shipping and receiving here. And she wraps every package with love, honestly, she, she does. She does. 
and she really wants to get home sometime this winter and snuggle with this, but it is a new kit for us. It's all different. <laughs> I just want to snuggle with I know. it. It's all different textures of minky. And super fun. So here's a here's a pro tip from Pine Needles. And she backed it. I gotta show this too because it's really neat. She it's backed gorgeous. it with blue minky and did um, one of our gals here did a snowflake. I don't know if they could see it that good. A snowflake. And um, look at how I Laura know, finished she the edges. Did a she went decorative all out stitch. with this gorgeous decorative stitch. She did. But this is just nummy. All different textures and things in there. And they are different thicknesses. And here's a pro tip from us. Uh, if you haven't worked with minky, cuddle, snuggle, whatever you want to call this, it um, leaves little bunny fluffs everywhere. It sheds. Everywhere. A bit. It sheds. Yep. Put it in your dryer. But be sure to clean the dryer lint. Just put it on, on low and let it fluff up a little bit. That will help. Or don't care. Just leave it go over your, all over your sewing room and then. Well, these are all, um, I think, nine inch squares that you cut. And what, what I do is when I have the nine inch squares cut, I, I just grab them all up and then I take them out to my deck and I shake them and shake them and shake them and then come back in and, and sew. And that helps, helps with some of the. But once it's done, it doesn't shed anymore. It's just when you cut it. Right. And yep. this is called Big Kid Snug as a Bug Quilt. And the pattern is just as Marcia said, it's on here. This is your pattern. You just Very cut basic. as many nine inch squares as you can, and you use as many as you want. And I think she used all of them. She had a few left over, but it makes a really nice size quilt for anyone, even a tall person. I have two more things so over snuggly. here. So snuggly. Oh, yeah. Well, we were going to talk about some of the things that. Oh, yeah. So. Some for the baby lock, I was going to talk about all the extras that we have. So we have feet, we have software, lots of different kinds of software. Right. So all of this for you baby lock lovers, it's all 35% off right now. Correct. So you'll want to come in and get yours. All right. So earlier this month we did the 12 things in December. Thank you for the overwhelming response in the uh, purchasing of all these things. The first thing to sell out was this fancy schmancy kit. And we made it out of this gorgeous Poinsettia Plaza fabric. So if you're one of those who are sad that you did not get the pattern or the kit, we will be ordering more. We have a couple on hand. We will fill your order if you would like the pattern. Now, this pattern yep. does not does not look, look like anything out like of the, the Christmas quilt. fabric. Because it's truly right these fabrics made it elegant and gorgeous right so these are half yard cuts so it's not exactly going to be the same as ours but very 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 similar so right so in the kitting it calls for 16 assorted fat quarters these are half yard cuts as marcia said so that would give you 18 fat quarters from these half yard cuts we have yard goods we don't have we don't have um, enough of the exact background to re-kit it as we made the sample. However, it's just a cream. It's just a cream, and we have lots of those. So I, That's I would Christmas suggest you shop there. Uh, in our web store and make sure you get you know a pretty cream. Uh, or you could call us or stop in. Right, exactly. We can help with or that. Too. Or a grunge your stash. would be, be great too that goes with oh, that. Oh, yeah. Too, there, so. There's lots of options, but we do have half year cuts because we got to thinking it was so. You still can't So make many quilt. disappointed people. I know that we didn't. We ran out of kits. <laughs> but know that this is an option. Yep, and you can, and it can be very similar. Um, okay, speaking of our wonderful long arm quilters here. Um, tomorrow is the very last day for you to bring your quilts in to ensure that they get quilted for Christmas. We have one, two, three. We have five four, long arms. Five long arms. So we can still get your things done for Christmas. Um, well, and if they have to burn the midnight oil, we, did, we, we will, talked about it earlier. What if we, we get will, flooded tomorrow with them? We will we'll get them done. We'll get them done. So, But tomorrow is the last day for you to bring your quilts in to get them done for Christmas. And we'll take care of the batting and the thread. You just need to fill out the That's form right. and, and pick Our, up a backing on your way in. Or right. or pick one up when you get here. Right. Batting is always included. That's and what thread. I meant. Pack, pick, it, yes. pick it up when you bring your top With in. With our quilting we can help fees, you select. batting is always included. And it is the wonderful 80-20 uh, quilter's, quilter's dream. dream. That's a quilt shop only batting. And it's gorgeous. So the last thing, but not the least thing, is the auction quilt and we have a lovely christmas quilt oh, i love this quilt uh, you, they can't really see the 
ribbons at the top, but that's okay. You can see it. I'm going to post, well, Marcia a, will post, post a, picture a picture of it tomorrow. Um, this is a Kim Deal mm -hmm. pattern and fabric, Kim Deal fabric. So kind of a, it's called Farmhouse Christmas. So it's going to be a really fun one. It'll be fun for you because you'll be able to get it um, after Saturday and you can put it in your house for your own holiday cel celebration as well. Right. So I think we're wow. about ready to button this up. Did we forget anything? Uh, not that I can remember. Oh, yes, we did forget one thing. <laughs> oh. Next week, we're not going to do this sit-down thing like we do, but what we're actually going to do is take you on a little tour through our messy shop, and also we're going to show you the progress over on the other side. What? What's we're going to do happening. a behind the scenes? We're going to do a little behind the scenes. I know we're going to do It probably the won't be as long, and it's going to be kind of a little short thing, but I think that'll be fun so that, right. that you all can see what we're doing here and, and what the future holds for us. It's going right. to be really a lot of fun. I think that's it. I think that's do we it, need too. To put our I ho -ho think we do home. need to put these on. Now, now, what was that joke about why does, why does Santa have more than one garden? Because he wants to ho-ho-ho. <laughs> Right. All right. Thank you so much for joining us here today live at Pine Needles Quilt and Sew in Rochester, Minnesota. And until next time, we will keep you in stitches. Thanks so much, everybody. Bye. Bye-bye.